The souls underneath Jeff Darren Muse have taken him all over the country. He was once a wilderness educator as a park ranger with his wife, Paula. And if it's outdoors... I generally would describe myself as a tree hugger. That's where Jeff would like to spend most of his days, but recently those hiking boots have left the outdoors for more time here at the Ivy Brain Tumor Center at Barrow Neurological Institution in Phoenix. You see, more than two years ago, Jeff was diagnosed with the deadliest form of a brain tumor an adult can get glioblastoma. Angry at times, sad at times, fearful at times. Um, I had to wrestle with what felt like life being destroyed. Fact is, there is not a cure to glioblastoma. Life expectancy after a diagnosis is give or take 15 months. But Jeff had a game plan on how to manage life after a deadly diagnosis. I've been thinking a lot about that word, stable. Before the intense headaches led to the MRI's discovery of the tumor, Jeff was writing a now-published series of essays about the geography of hope called Dear Park Ranger. In it, he describes his life's mantra through four experiences that you have to face to live in the moment. That's agony, endurance, comfort, then pleasure. Little did he know at the time that that was the daily equation that allowed him, in part, to live stably after two separate stints with the incurable disease. As time has gone on, fighting brain cancer, and this would be my, my recommendation for anyone, is uh, you have to develop a, a daily focus. I can't quite look at the long horizon. Um, I, I try not to. I try to focus day by day by day. His doctor, Nader Sinai, the director at Ivy Brain Tumor Center, says an experimental clinical trial reduced the severity of his second tumor, but Jeff's attitude to fight back plays a key role in his health. Everyone does better in their health when they're coming in with positive mental energy as well as positive physical energy. And Jeff does that really well. This may be the toughest mountain Jeff has climbed, but to him, he's happy just to be climbing. I need to write either an addendum um, or perhaps that next book. Um, I'm working on it. Jordan Bonke, ABC 15, Arizona.